coming. I'm coming, all right, Sam? If that's you, I'm... It's not. Did you lose your key? My nerve. I figured it was safer to knock, considering how angry you were at me the last time we saw each other. How are you? You answer that question. I thought you had the flu. Yes, I do. But I'm willing to share. Well, you seem to be in fairly good shape. Well, I'm, I'm feeling better, yes, except for this uh, sort of icky feeling I have in my tummy. Why? What's wrong? I didn't like the way we left things at the hospital the last time we saw each other. We've never had a fight like that before, where you've walked out before we've had a chance to get things back together. Well, I was furious. You were flat on your back. It was easy. <laughs> I didn't like the way we left things at the hospital the last time we saw each other. We've never had a fight like that before, where you've walked out before we've had a chance to get things back together. Well. I was furious. You were flat on your back. It was easy. <laughs> the Reba factor. Hmm. It's worse now than it's ever been, isn't it? Every time I feel like we're getting closer, you and I, uh, somehow Reva gets in there and things get messed up. It's, I don't think it's really her. I think it's more her energy, her um, charge that gets into our heads. And uh, sort of short circuits us. Uh, did she enjoy having you all to herself the last few days? I actually haven't seen her since Diego's funeral. She's been working on this investigation. You? I've been alone for the first time in quite a while. Do you uh, have any big revelations? Well, I'm here, right? <laughs> yeah. Um, yes, I did, I, I did uh, realize something. As tough as it is to have Reva constantly in our lives, there's something that's even tougher than that, and that's not having you in my life. I missed you. I had a revelation, too. What was that? That fight. Um, we can call it Reva's energy charge, whatever, but I, I, I think it was more my fault. No. It, no, it, it yeah. Look, you, you have a hard time getting her out of your head, and, and she is totally obsessed with you. I will stand by that. But the real trouble comes when I bring her into the mix, you know, invariably as some suburban she-devil. Point is, is that I, I, I have to focus on my behavior and not hers. For instance? For instance, um, I hate it when she does anything decent. And it really kills me to see you admire her. It's, it's just jealousy, and I know it has to change. And I, I know that I have to accept her, you know? I, even her good points. She does have a few. Josh, I know she has good points. Like, it's just selfish and absurd for me to th think that she can be totally out of your life, you know? I mean, she's, she's Mara and Shane's mom. That's a permanent connection. The trick is, at least for me, is just, just to try and find some way to not let her ruin all the good things that we have. I really missed you. So, where does this leave us? Where do we go from here? Hmm? Well, I, I, 
have a plan. <sighs> like I usually do. I, uh, I figure we just focus on the areas of our relationship that don't have conflict, and we build on that. Building is good. You're good. I'm sorry for all the grief I've caused you. Shh. Let me suffer in silence. Are you, um, still contagious? Well, now, not if I kiss you here. No. Or maybe here. Just dozing a little bit. Mm. How do you feel? Two thumbs up. All right. <laughs> Get up. Excuse me? You've got to go. What do you mean I have to go? I just got here. Well, if the party were here. Oh, You'd be welcome to stay, but it party. isn't, so get up to We don't have to go to the party. Yes, we do. Richard and Cassie won't know if we're not there. Yeah, but the Spaldings will. Oh. Look, they're calling it a party, but underneath all those cute little canapes, it's business, and they will miss okay, us. So okay, get up, okay, go okay, get dressed. Okay. You know, it's awfully quiet around here. Where's your biker brother? Sam is at a party of his own. He's a company. Well, good for him to have a social life here that quick. That's great. Sam would have a social life if he were alone yeah. in a lifeboat. It's Are good for him. It's great for us. What do you mean? Well, he's... Out on the town, that means we can stay in on the sofa and we can uh -oh. just do what we, what we just did all over again. How no. would that be, huh? No, Come I on. mean it. You have to go. <laughs> Get dressed. I'll meet you at Towers. How will I recognize you? I'll be all flushed and feverish, but not from the flu. Mm. 